In the realm of space exploration and the search for alien life, Jupiter's moon Europa has often been at the forefront of the discussion. And for good reason. NASA scientists have compelling evidence for a liquid ocean beneath its icy surface, including the observation of warm regions either on or close to the surface. But move over Europa because another moon has been causing a stir within the scientific community. Woo! While Europa is still in the picture, the fuss now is all about Enceladus, satellite of Saturn. Saturn, of course, is the sixth planet. The one God loved the most because he put a ring on it or some shit. Do you want to know how many moons Saturn has? It has... 82 to be exact, and scientists are interested in a few of them, including Titan, but that's another video. Enceladus has captured the attention of scientists because spacecraft Cassini has observed icy jets spewing into space, leading them to believe that there is a liquid ocean below its icy surface. But what's different about Enceladus is that we know it harbors organic compounds. Those are the building blocks for life. Say what? According to a Business Insider article dated last year, a new analysis of NASA data revealed the presence of these organic compounds in the moon's space-bound icy jets. Spacecraft Cassini had been able to sense them as it flew nearby. Using modeling designed to mirror processes that occur on Earth, scientists theorize that Enceladus may create life in a similar fashion. That is, through chemical reactions that occur inside hydrothermal vents deep within the ocean. A mission to Titan sometime in the 2020s is already confirmed, but now scientists are also pitching for a separate mission to Enceladus to investigate further, and sci-fi fans are already fantasizing about what might be lurking in those alien waters. So while a mission is possible at this stage, it's not yet confirmed. In the meantime, if you want to satisfy your curiosity, you can watch this all right movie called Europa Report. It shows what becomes of humanity's first crew to the alien moon. It's not an amazing movie and it's not exactly about Enceladus, but hey, if you're still in quarantine or lockdown, it's something to do. Me, I've been playing a lot of Universe Sandbox, which is what I used to create some of the stock footage used for this video. And I've also been working on my own planet, Imnara. There she is. And there's Kaluda, which has frozen over because I positioned it wrong. It's actually supposed to be a water world. And there's Anidium. I should probably add the suns in at some point. Anyway, keep your eye on this channel. I'll be posting an update on the mission to Titan soon. And there's a second project coming to the Yeah I Said It Productions channel as well. Thanks for watching. See you soon, everyone.